It's the continuation of President Muhammadu Buhari's administration's scorecard series, where ministers take turns to inform Nigerians on what their ministries and past titles have achieved in the past seven and a half years. It's the turn of the Minister of Foreign Affairs, Geoffrey Onyama, and he says Nigeria has repatriated more than two billion pounds of looted funds, strengthened multilateral cooperation through beneficial economic partnerships, and also entered into several defense and security cooperation which have helped to secure the country through the purchase of arms to boost the fight against terrorism. Like the Open Governance uh, um, uh, Organization, a uh, uh, partnership to start to uh, have repatriated a lot of uh, loot that was stolen out of this country. And, um, you know, in a huge amount, about two billion, it's reckoned, uh, uh, pound sterling of uh, Nigerian um, assets, uh, uh, loot stashed in foreign uh, countries. In the area of trade, the foreign minister says the government has signed over 30 bilateral agreements with many countries on the continent and across the world. Uh, we've been able to uh, export and uh, facilitate the export to South Africa over 2.16 uh, billion dollars of goods from Nigeria and, um, and uh, um, South Africa has imported and uh, has exported to us half a billion dollars. So we have a trade surplus with uh, South Africa. Of course, we signed the African continental free trade uh, area, which is going to be the largest free trade area in the world. Onyema also says the Nigerian government has helped to restore democracy in some countries, including Guinea-Bissau, when it was under threat. The initiatives and steps he's taken on good governance. He's been against uh, uh, third terms, elongation, changing constitutions uh, for, you know, to, 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 to stay in power in other countries. And uh, so he's known, even in West Africa, uh, as, uh, as somebody who will not uh, tolerate that. And his voice is really heard uh, in, on the, in the sub-region. And of course, you know, we've had some backsliding of some countries that have had coups uh, uh, recently. The Buhari's administration scorecard series continues next week. Punarman Benjamin, Arise News.